I think the acting is amazing. They were all universally just really knocking it out of the park. It's really when the game feels like a game, is, is that moment when they start talking. I hate working with actors because they <laughs> I am so specific with every stupid damn word in, in these scripts. And then if they say it even better, but not what I had in my head, it takes me forever to just rectify it. But it was thankfully very fun. And I was able to just quickly get over all my insecurities and issues. <laughs> oh yeah? What was that one called? Peabody, I think. I'm trying to remember the sign, but like half the letters had fallen off, so it spelled pea pork. The little people on the screen, but they're real to me, especially when they started saying words. It's just so cute. Like, oh, look, he said hello, you know, like a little baby. Right around the time we do the animation work um, is usually the time we're actually getting the voice actors' lines in the game, and that just changes the whole feel of the game. Before we had the voices in, we just had subtitles at the bottom, so we'd have to read everything. And we were like, this game kind of sucks. I don't know, what are we gonna do? This isn't going anywhere. Sometimes you play games and you're like, that nah, people wouldn't really say this stuff to each other. But like this is, it's like you talking to your friends. It's when you can latch on to writing in a game, it's still such a rare thing to have actual emotive conversations. And once we got the voices in, it was just like, oh my God, this works. Like this, these are people. These are like real people having a conversation. Did you flip? Because it kind of did the opposite of what we wanted. I flipped the... Uh, it's the only one, Jonas. What other switch could I even flip? Oh, good point. We started off with Alex's dialogue. I'm like, yes, I finally know who you are now. It was the first time I voiced a playable character that had so much to say. Just gave me a way better idea of who Alex was. The nuances of how she speaks, how air is expelled from <laughs> this area. <laughs> the cool thing about Alex is she only speaks when you tell her to and she'll only say what you tell her to. And being able to see all these different directions that this character could go and knowing that people playing the game are gonna have so many different versions of this, this character that we're all working to create, I thought that was really cool. What is this? What is this? What does this mean? Who, who are you? I feel like it was a bit more intimate because sometimes you work on games that are such a sprawling project. But like this, I could text Sean if I had a question, you know? I mean, it's nice to have Adam being the one directing the sessions because he's the writer. And so if there's something he didn't like, he would change it on the spot and we'd fix it. It's like the most mentally exhausting thing because you're just, you can't not to pay attention. They all have so many lines and so many scenes and so many versions. And it's just a very hard script to perform because it's all out of order. Yeah, hopping around in the timeline and recording out of order was a little yeah. confusing. So it's gonna be a wild ride playing the game for the yeah, first time. <laughs> like I'm surprised at how well the conversations work given that they were not in the studio together. I continuously find it crazy that they all recorded their voices separately and when you play the game it's just it's crazy how well they work together. We recorded a lot of it during the summer and their AC broke for a few days. They brought in like eight fans and they would aim them literally like this at her and then between takes they would like blast them and then they would have to turn them off and she'd be like I can't breathe. <laughs> I mean, just from what I've heard of him, like that one story about the cops just straight buying him a beer. I mean, just what would a guy like that see in her? Like, at least at the start. You know, Jonas, frankly, I don't really know and I don't really care. So Clarissa antagonizes Alex consistently through the whole game, which would be fun when I would come in and be like, how horrible am I today? Like, and it was, there was like a baseline of just, it was consistently pretty mean to everybody. I would take Clarissa's in insults very personally. <laughs> well, she's around here somewhere. She is so annoying, God. She's that girl from high school that you hated. Yeah, she's that girl. She really is. <laughs> yeah. Holiday party, um, that was like the compliment I kept getting. It was like, oh, I hate you. Um, that was nice. I was so excited to record Alex's comebacks in those conversations and being able to say all these mean things Burr. about her. So it was so fun. I don't really know why I'm so horrible to her. And then, uh, you know, I got my reasons. Life's hard. And even Clarissa, who's perhaps the most unrelatable character, you know, she has her reasons for everything. It's funny you say least relatable character. I've definitely talked to other people who've played it now who yeah. are like, I totally get where she's coming from. Like, she's the hero of the story. I'm like, what? I haven't seen how Clarissa looks. Does she look mean? I bet she looks cool. 
Uh, speaking of which, she dated Michael? Is that right? <sighs> yes, quite annoyingly. I'm a huge fan of games. I play a lot of games, so to work on something that this is something I would want to play just makes it even cooler. I can't wait to play. I'm so excited to play it. Not only because we're in it and I want to kind of see the final product, um, but it's totally a game I would play. I mean, it's this giant environment, lots of narrative character, nitty gritty stuff like that, and it's spooky. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, make sure to subscribe to Skybound. There's oxen free videos all week, and make sure to go to oxenfreegame.com to check out the game. It's available on Windows 10, on Xbox, on Steam, on so many cool things. Matt. And if and if you are, <laughs> it's. It's on Mac. It's not on. It's it, it, <laughs> never mind. It's available somewhere. Just play the game and subscribe.